Hey guys. All right, folks, we're here today to do a double header. We normally don't do double headers outside of Mondays anymore, but today we felt the need to do a double header because I really wanted to check out these two videos and I didn't want to take some, some other video slot, not slot, slot. And so I figured, okay, let's just group them together and let's sit down today to watch two videos of two bands that we absolutely love, enjoy, and have a passion for. Yeah. We're not going to get into what the second video is. You guys will find out once we post it. But to start off, let's look at Ginger. They released on last Friday when there was that huge gangbang followed by an explosive bukkake of videos. Ginger released a brand new video for their song Perennial, which makes sense because that Friday, January 11th, they released their brand new EP, Micro. This song is from that EP. Now, full disclosure, I did an EP review that I posted a month Yes, you guys can click on the top there. Wow, I haven't done that in so long. Uh, yeah, you haven't done that in a long time. I did an EP review a month before the release came out because I couldn't I, I couldn't hold it in. The moment I got it, I had to listen to it and I had to record an EP review. So obviously I, I heard this song, but I haven't seen the video. And I haven't heard the song. I, and you haven't seen the video. So let me say this. There's no way Ginger puts out an official video and I'm not and we're not checking it out. It's it's not happening. And I'll tell you for... It's like, it's like one of the commandments. Thou shall watch Ginger and thou shall like. Exactly. So, plus it's like this. The vid, it's not a lyric video. This is a music video. Yeah. So we're going to get ourselves a little bit of Tatiana. You know, and, and there's nothing bad about that. There's only goodness to come from that. Which when you went to go see Ginger, she had weed pants. She had like... Yeah, she had these uh, stretchy pants. You know, sometimes yeah. at night, yeah. uh, you need to wear stretchy pants. To quote... Uh, Nacho Libre! I love that movie, by the way. Yeah. Anyways, uh, so I'm really excited about checking the video uh, because it's an actual video, and I want to see the guys in Ginger. I love Eugene and the whole gang. Um, Eugene is, by the way, he's like doing jujutsu or something like that. Like he's bulking up. He's getting like oh. he's starting to look like Jason Momoa. So I, I kind of troll him a little bit on Facebook, and I call him. I said I didn't know Jason Momoa played bass, and then he and then he actually replied to me with a video. <laughs> Uh, of Jason Momoa playing bass, and he I goes, like, uh, "Yes, he does." And he's like, "I was like, shit, the joke is on me." I feel like he got tired of you calling him Jason Momoa. <laughs> it's a compliment, though. Come on. That he knew he was. And he knew. You already had it ready for the next time yeah, I do because, it. Boom. Because it like, was like two seconds. Yeah, because he's like, "Okay, I'm gonna post this video of me playing bass," but I know, I know you have something up your sleeve, so I'm gonna just search up a video of Jason. Momoa. And just have it in my in my paste yeah. folder and be ready to go. It was really it's quick, so I, I, I don't. Yeah, I don't think he searched it. I think he already had it ready. He was cocked and loaded. He was just boom. Anyways, I just want to say one more thing, quick thing before we start watching this video. My favorite song on this EP has five songs. The, the fifth song is an um, instrumental, a really short instrumental track. Uh, but one of my favorite songs on this EP is Teacher Teacher, specifically from a, a lyric perspective. From the lyrics, it had a little bit of a Pink Floyd vibe to it. You know, like that line from Pink Floyd, teacher, leave the kids alone. It, it, even the song itself had to me, not just the lyrics, but the song itself had a little bit of a Pink Floyd vibe to it. I really love that song. I actually haven't heard of Pink Floyd. Well, I've heard of him, but I just haven't listened it's to him. It's not him. It's a band. Oh. There's not a dude named Pink Floyd. Wait, you think his name is Floyd and he wears pink? Yeah. Oh, God. All right. This, this is a conversation for another video. We need, now we need to do some Pink Floyd on the channel. No. Why? It's amazing. Pink Floyd is, is amazing. Actually... Yeah. Are you kidding me? Ah, oh, we, we need to we need to do this on a throwback. It has to be on a throwback Thursday. All right, Ginger Perennial. Like I said, I, I was kind of hoping when when I heard that they were releasing a video, I was kind of hoping there was going to be Teacher Teacher, but I'll I'll take Perennial. All right, ready? Yeah. Exhausted, and you're so tragic, and so it's not all. Who holds me down? 
you go first because obviously i knew the song already yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I didn't know the video but i knew the song uh, the middle part there right when it starts to nice like get nice and mellow the yeah bass. It, was, it was just and it's just her with her clean vocals and just Which, her clean vocals i know we've said it so many times but the, it they're so good her clean vocals you know i'm smiling you know why i'm smiling why when I did the album review, well not the album, this is an EP. When I did the EP review, I said that Tatiana's vocals on this EP are perhaps the best yeah. I've heard from her on any Ginger song record. And I said on that same EP, what you just said, that her clean vocals on this EP are absolutely out of this world good. Everybody concentrates on, on her harsh vocals and how yeah. unique they are and how unique she makes her music. I said on this EP that her clean vocals were absolutely out of this world godly and they were incredible. So it's funny that you listening to this song, you say that. I said that same thing when I did my EP review in early December when I first got the EP from Napalm Records to check it out. And uh, I remember sending a message to Eugene saying, dude, I just got your EP. It's, it's killer, killer, killer. It's absolutely killer. The only thing I would have done different is the 
the put, they put micro the instrumental track at, as the last track i would have put that as the first track it would have been that. such a beautiful way to because it's absolutely beautiful the instrumental it would have been such a neat a cool way to start off the song the i mean the ep and then let that song bleed into the first song which which is ape so like bleed that song into that i think that would have made it All like uh, that would have made a 10 out of 10 as it is to me is like a, a 9 9.5 out of 10 like it's it's still great. I would have just added, had that song as number one versus his, uh, that, the last song. That part it gets so mellow. It, it's still. I mean, if you have the album, sorry, if you have the album on loop, having it as the last song, it kind of becomes the first song, yeah. anyways. But I would have changed the order. That's the only thing. The the middle part there when it starts to get all mellow and she has her clean vocals, the bass, you can really hear it. It sounds so nice. He's killer. He is. He's killer. He's killer on the bass. I'm actually. Pretty bummed out that Ginger is going to be at Vagus Metal Fest this summer in Portugal. We were there last year. And we're not there. Because I would have invited them to come over to our town and hang out with us. And they could have stayed there instead of spending money on hotels and stuff. Because they could have stayed at one of your grandmother's apartments. So I'm really bummed out about that. Because I really like these guys. They're like... By the way, another thing I noticed in the video. This is the first time I see Roman in a video without a hat on. Oh. I think. I mean... I, I could be wrong, but oh. even live, he wears a, a cap backwards. I think I I think every video from Ginger, oh man, now I have to really go back. But I don't ever remember seeing him playing guitar without having a hat on and just his hair like bouncing around like he had in this video. So that was kind of cool, kind of different. Anyways, uh, anything else you you have to add to the? By the way, did you did you get the lyrics of the song? Not. I, I was more focused on watching the part where everyone was just. Just headbanging and they're going I, crazy. By the way, what did you think about the video uh, in terms of, of the of the darkness, them coming out of the dark and back into the dark? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought that was really well done. By by the whoever filmed the video, that was really hats smartly done. Yeah, yeah, hats off. Really, really cool. Like really cool the way they did that of them coming in and out of the darkness and, and playing and ripping it up. I really enjoyed that. That dynamic in the video was really cool. The lyrics of the song is really about Earth, planet Earth, and and how us humans are 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 destroying our planet and perhaps even driving, uh, you know, driving our own selves into like extinction and how we don't take care of the planet and 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 those and those that live here and around us and how we tend to destroy and take things for granted. So along, I'm putting it in generic uh, terms, but that's kind of what the lyrics are about. This record has really deep lyrics because if you think about dreadful moments, it was all about abuse. Uh, you know, child abuse, sexual abuse, uh, yeah. abuse in general. Uh, ape is also about humans and how we're, you know, like we evolved from the ape, but maybe we haven't evolved as much as we think we have because we still have a lot of animalistic uh, things about ourselves that we do things that we shouldn't do. Um, teacher, teacher is about, um, it's about a teacher, like in, in the, the role that a teacher has in the child's life and, and grooming you and, and giving you a sense of, of who you are, teaching you, being your guide. And, and that, that doesn't apply just to a teacher. It really applies, uh, the lyrics re refer to teacher, but the, it really applies to any adult in a child's any life, guardian. any guardian in a child's life that is there as a mentor, as a guide. So we're supposed to be there to guide you through your life, to be your protector, to be your, 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 your guiding angel, if you will. We're not there to take advantage of you, to, to hurt you in any way, to put you in a situation that you don't need to be, to teach you hateful things. Like we see sometimes videos of little kids uh, in the Ku Klux Klan, the kid wasn't born KKK. It was the parents that took him yeah. and are now brainwashing him to have those kind of beliefs. So that song, teacher, teacher is pretty much about that. How we how we have people in these positions of of power over children and over youth, and instead of of doing them a service, they're doing them a disservice. That's what. So in the, in a nutshell, I just went through the whole EP. I, what I said on my review, I can just I just kind of said it now to you. You did in like two minutes. I just did it quicker. My yeah. it was like 10 minutes because I went into a lot more details about the songs and things like that. All right, guys, this is it for this ginger video. But come back right after this. There's another video that was... This video is not from the Bukaki on Friday. No. This video is from the Bukaki that happened at Christmas, but because of the holidays, it completely went under my radar. I didn't realize until this Friday that there was a video. Yeah. And, and I guess people were commenting in the comment section, but we, it was the holidays. I wasn't really reading the so comments. People were so. commenting like... You guys always do Ice Nine Kills whenever the videos Why come out. Why did you out. say, oh, now you ruined the surprise. Oh, I ruined the surprise. Yes, the next video is Ice Nine Kills. Come back, guys. See ya. See ya.